our play-by-play -play announcer for this night. We've got a lot of great racing here. We'll have the women's and men's 100 backstroke, and that'll be followed by the women's 400 freestyle, and then the men's 100 freestyle, and then we'll have the women's and men's 200 breaststroke, and then we'll follow that up with the women's and men's 100 butterfly. And we're starting now with the women's 100 backstroke. This is the E final now in the water. We'll give you the lanes after the start. Swimming in lane number one at the bottom of the screen is Susanna La Rochelle from McCallie GPS Aquatics. In lane two, Chloe Hicks from Machine Aquatics. Three, Alice Truth, Coastal Aquatic Swim Team. Four is Emily Ryan, swimming unattached. Four, Alexandra Sumner, Suburban Seahawks. Five, Sydney Pacetti, Poseidon Swimming. Seven, Sophie Skinner, Northern Kentucky Clippers. And lane eight, Molly Pulte, Motor City Aquatics. Well, first, that's Alexandra Sumner, 31.06. And Sumner's got a three quarter body link lead. They swam short course yards and prelims this morning, and now they're swimming long course. It looks like Sumner really excels in long course swimming. And she's going to win the E final. 103.94. The only swim under 104. It's a great start. At least this first of five heats with the women's hunter back. Definitely we're going to be seeing the time. We should see the time get faster. Of course.